Hey guys, so the first thing I'm going to do is just show you my part. It's not perfect, but I got it part from ear to ear. And then you're going to see me applying my flaxseed oil, no, black castor flaxseed oil gel, my Eco Styler gel. I absolutely love this gel. It's great for my hair. It's perfect for wash and goes, especially wash and goes. I love how it defines my curls. And I like that it has vitamin E, fiber, and omega 3 in it. So it's really good for your hair. It's anti itch. It does flake if you don't if your hair is really dry so make sure you keep your hair moisturized while you use this but I absolutely love it it smells like perfume it smells so good and I just love it for my hair so if you don't have this gel then make sure you definitely go check out your local beauty supply store but I'm just smoothing my edges and trying to lay my baby hairs to where my little annoying bald spot is not in the way but you yeah, know what can you do Then I'm going to use my little brush that I got from my beauty supply store and smooth up my edges because I could not find my little mini toothbrush that I use for my edges. I don't know what I did with it so I'm just going to use that and put it into one ponytail and then I'm just going to twist it up just like so. And while you're at it make sure you click that subscribe button if you like what you see. Then I'm going to get my Outre Ariana lace front wig and I'm going to put the clip, the combs in the sides of my hair. I don't have, don't know how to braid so I just put my hair slicked back, plaited it and then put it in a little, pony, little ponytail and bobby pinned it. And I'm going to put the combs in the sides of my hair and then I'm going to bobby pin the wig down to make sure that it's secure and won't come off or anything like that. And I like it like this because you can see the part which is what I'm showing right now. It just makes it look more natural than how I was doing it. And then I'm going to use some bobby pins, like I said, and just pin it down. I'm going to put more pins in, but I just don't show it on, vi on video. You want to make sure that's secure. Then I'm going to grab some hair from the front of the lace front wig and pull it up. I'm going to try and make it as thick as I want and then I'm going to, you know, fix the rest of the hair to make sure that I have the right amount of hair that I want and make adjustments as necessary. Then I'm going to grab a rubber band as you see here and make one big ponytail. I'm going to combine my hair and the hair from this lace front wig and put it into one big ponytail. Then I'm going to secure my little twist down and then I'm going to take the curly hair and wrap it around this and bobby pin it down. You can make it as thick or as big or as little as you want to. I like my buns to be big but I want to make sure to cover up my hair so I'm just going to go, I think I went in a counterclockwise position um, and just going to keep pinning and stretching and pulling and adjusting. You can do this as big or as little as you want and it's completely up to you how you want this to look. Pretty self-explanatory, I'm just going to keep putting bobby pins and adjusting this bun till I get it the way that I want it to be. And now I'm just fluffing out the hair to make sure that it's, as, it's the perfect length and I have the right amount of hair in my bun. I'm going to push, not push, but I'm going to see me squeeze my bun out because I want it to be just a little bit thicker to match all this beautiful curly hair. I absolutely love this wig and watching her video really made me, you know, figure out a different way to wear this wig so I'm really glad that I saw her video. Then I'm going to use my little silk scarf and tie down my edges and I, excuse me, I left it like this all while I did my makeup and then I took it off and my edges were laid and this is how it came out. I'm absolutely loving this hairstyle, it's super cute, it's for a date night or a night out with the girls or just a casual run to the store look, whatever you want to use this for, it's absolutely gorgeous and I love it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and on Snapchat to keep up with me in my daily life and, don't, and I thank you guys so much for watching this video and have a good day.